A spy robot in the form of an orangutan is an innovative tool for discrete and covert reconnaissance in environments where orangutans reside. This animatronic agent can be used to study and observe the behavior of wild orangutans, providing scientists with valuable data about their natural habitat. Its advanced sensors and cameras enable the spy robot to authentically mimic orangutan behavior and record the surrounding environment. This approach opens up new perspectives for scientific research in the fields of zoology and animal behavior, offering a deeper understanding of their lives in the wild. This innovative technology can also be applied to the conservation of wild orangutans by allowing closer monitoring of their lives and identifying potential threats, such as poaching or habitat loss. The orangutan robotic spy could become a valuable tool for maintaining ecosystem balance and preserving this unique species. While horses have not yet become rare animals, they have also not escaped the realm of robotics. In Japan, the JRA company has unveiled a robot horse that realistically moves its head, flaps its lips, and snorts. Unfortunately, this robo-horse cannot gallop or even walk. Such creations are typically referred to as animatronics. They find primary uses in amusement parks and film studios. Although unnamed, it is an incredibly impressive sight, as one would expect, considering that it cost the JRA around 10 million yen, roughly 80,000 euros. The robot turned out to be so realistic that passers-by were convinced they were looking at a live horse. However, the movements of this horse were slightly unusual, inevitably drawing attention. Imagine their surprise when they realized it wasn't just an ordinary horse, but a genuine, hyper-realistic robot. In Brazil, robots resembling wild animals have been deployed to the Pantanal wetlands to observe wildlife and transmit data. The British studio John Downer Productions, specializing in nature filming using robotic animals, sent a jaguar robot and a caiman robot, alligator family, to Brazil. It is noted that these robotic animals have integrated into the Pantanal wetlands environment. In this unique ecosystem, there are 463 species of birds, 269 species of fish, 41 species of reptiles and amphibians, thousands of invertebrate subspecies, and hundreds of mammal species. Filming from the water was conducted by a robotic Paraguayan caiman, while while on land, it was assisted by a jaguar cub, as reported by National Geographic. In the footage, the jaguar appears more like a soft toy, but the alligator exploring the water looks remarkably realistic. This is another robotic spy animal video from John Downer Productions, this time featuring a robotic grizzly bear cub and a salmon robot capturing some footage of wild grizzly bears as they fish in a river. The task of a robotic spy bear is to move discreetly within a territory, collecting reconnaissance information. It is typically equipped with modern sensors and cameras, allowing it to effectively interact with the surrounding environment. The size and shape of the bear make it less suspicious and facilitate a silent approach to the target. A salmon-shaped spy robot represents an innovative approach to reconnaissance technologies. Its natural form enables it to move unnoticed in aquatic environments, gathering valuable data and providing unique capabilities for underwater surveillance. This hyper-realistic robotic dolphin, named Dell, comes with a price tag of $3 million and holds the potential to liberate captive dolphins around the world through a blend of mechanical innovation and advanced puppetry. Developed by Edge Innovations, Dell weighs more than 500 pounds and spans 8.5 feet in length, mirroring the dimensions of a real bottlenose dolphin. What sets Dell apart is her medical-grade silicone skin and seamlessly mechanical movements, creating a lifelike appearance that is nearly indistinguishable from a real dolphin based on looks alone. Edge Innovations explains that Dell comes to life through a combination of puppeteering, programming, and artificial intelligence. The vision at Edge Innovations is optimistic, foreseeing animatronic dolphins as potential replacements for wild animals confined in captivity for marine park attractions. As of 2023, there were 3,029 dolphins held in captivity across marine parks globally, constituting an industry that generates between $1.1 and $5.5 billion annually, according to estimates by World Animal Protection. These vibrant and intelligent creatures would typically enjoy ranges of 100 square kilometers, 38.6 square miles in the wild, but are instead kept in enclosures 77,000 times smaller and forced to perform for crowds. While it's not feasible to instantly free every captive dolphin and replace them with Dell, as many lack the natural skills needed for survival in the wild, Edge Innovations proposes a gradual transition to robotic dolphins as an alternative to breeding new ones in captivity. This approach holds the potential to pave the way for a future without dolphins in captivity. Robotic Spy Puppy Meets Wild Dogs Robotic Spy Pup lives among a pack of wild dogs to film the emotional dynamics of wild dog life. By mimicking their body language he becomes accepted by the pack. It's kind of amazing how the animals seem suspicious of the robot dog. They sense something isn't totally right. 
Imagine if you leave your child to play with the other kids, and when you come back, there's a hyper-realistic robot baby with them. It's amazing how realistic it is. It is neat seeing how the dogs react to it, although it just showed up out of nowhere. Good opportunity to see that wild canines aren't just going to kill anything they see, and that they're often quite cautious and passive. The sheer realism of the robotic spy pup is a testament to technological advancements, prompting admiration as observers witness a surreal convergence of nature and artificial intelligence. Its unanticipated arrival adds an element of mystery, unraveling a narrative that mirrors the unpredictability of the wild. This is a video of an animatronic realistic gorilla in the wild. The video was a segment from a nature documentary made by John Downer Productions, in which an animatronic baby gorilla was sent to real gorillas to study them. Despite its somewhat jerky movements and its creepy camera lens eye, the robot otherwise looked like a convincing baby gorilla, and it was fascinating to watch the real gorillas interact with it. Curious baby gorillas showed an interest first, tapping the robot as an invitation to play, but suddenly the fun came to an end when an adult silverback told the other gorillas to back the fuck up so he can have a look. Daddy Gorilla cautiously examined the newcomer, and once the robot averted its eyes as a sign of respect, the green light was given, and the boss decided that he wouldn't smash the robot to bits. From there, adorable baby gorillas kept pounding their chests in an attempt to play with the robot, until one accidentally knocked him over and, possibly fearing he'd killed it, walked away sheepishly. The British company John Downer Productions has created a robot crab. They sent it to spy on the migration of the actual population of red crabs on Christmas Island, Australia. The robotic crab, externally very similar to a real one, joined the 40 million red crabs on their route from tropical forests to the shores of the Indian Ocean. Having infiltrated the animal group, the robot began to climb over fences, cross roads, and escape from predators and cannibalistic counterparts along with them. The project's creators aimed to illustrate the complex journey that crabs undergo during migration. Part of the process was captured by the creators themselves. They left the necessary equipment in a location where female crabs usually lay their eggs. This unique project not only visually documented the life of red crabs during migration, but also created unique scenes of interaction between the robot and the natural environment. Each robot shown in the video takes an average of six months to assemble. As you may have already guessed from the video, they are created to observe wildlife in their natural habitats. These spies are operated remotely, and the cameras are equipped with infrared technology that triggers movements when real animals approach. The cameras are embedded in the eyes of the artificial animals. These spy robots provide operators with unprecedented access to wild animals in their natural environments. A human or conventional cameras could never achieve such an effect. The most intriguing moments occur when the animals start interacting with the animatronics, leading to unexpected results. 